What's up Team Stone? This is Alvin Atwater or SYR456 for some of you and I'm back here at the grind again and today I just want to I guess talk a little about ATS and um, give a manga recommendation just a few things so I know some of you are you excited for volume 19 eh? Eh, because 19 I know it's been a slow process with 19 dealing with a couple of um things like burnout a few health complications and so it's been kind of slow but um hopefully you enjoy 19 um I enjoyed it especially that last fight scene it was pretty I liked I was I'm proud of it and you know what's coming up next of course would be the war on team viper right so good stuff is coming up so um yeah ats stuff so audiobook 18 of course it's still sitting in audible limbo um you probably you probably heard me um or saw me on discord and maybe even the facebook group i think mentioning me looking for a way to get away from the audible system that means of course switching to like a non-exclusive thing and then um distributing elsewhere like maybe youtube or any other what well, we have to see because you know I, I mean david has to get paid for this uh, everybody has to get paid for the time like i can't like i got i just got to figure out how i'm going to do this but if, once i do once I do, ATS will finally not be stuck. Cause man, it takes too long. I'm, I swear, it's just like a fucking sometimes up to uh, almost regularly two months. We finish like two months prior, um, and then you know, y'all, you know what happened with, of course, Volume Twelve. That's our favorite one. It's because of Audiobook Twelve that it, it you know, <laughs> the growth, um. Of ATS kind of went down because people were waiting so long and they just sort of just forgot many other things. But um, yeah, I, I don't I don't think Audible's on my side, so they they probably don't really like the content. And yeah, so they sort of limited it to one release every few months. So basically, they hold it and hold and hold. And they can tell you any kind of bullshit. I'm not stupid. I'm watching that thing, and I watch the pattern, and I finally, you know, I'm like, okay, so they want to limit how much they're paying us. Um, so they just hold it and hold it, and it can be a couple of months, and it really, it really blows. And I'm, I'm really tired of it. I know I didn't actually make this video to complain about um, ACX slash Audible's system, but I just, you know, I hate it. It sucks. It's been pro um, a problem. It actually only started being a problem maybe about eight months ago. Uh, was it 2020? A little bit before 2020, December 2019. Maybe around volume 10 is when it started acting a little weird. But then 2020, it just sort of went full blown anti Arthur mode, I guess, anti Andy. Some people probably got lucky though. Obviously, I'm not the only one. I'm just speaking from my point of view with this system. And I I don't know if they, I'm going to assume they're working ways to fix it. Some of it has gotten better, but for the most part, it's, it's almost every time we submit something, it's gonna be like a two month wait time. Two month, not, not a few days, not a few weeks. But fucking forever, man. Sometimes we're lucky, but I. When's the last time we've been lucky? I don't know, man. I think maybe was it sixteen or seventeen? Sixteen, probably seventeen. But anyway, that's not what I want to talk about. I just want to put that out there for eighteen. That it's all Audible has to do at this point is just put it out there. So it's it's been stuck in review hell. It's it's gonna be it's gonna always be like that until we find a new platform. Once again, I mean, unless you guys want me to like do what 
I don't have the audience for it. I'm making a joke. But um, like Michael Scott, MSE, Michael Scott Earl. He what he does is he just creates like this little Kickstarter and kickstart the entire whatever. Um, I don't. Know, I guess he knows all the numbers, so he does all of that, and his fans put in. I guess you know it's basically pre-ordering their audiobooks, so they give them you know put in all the money, and then after that, pays the narrator, and boom, y'all, um, MSE fans has the um, have the audiobooks without having to go through Amazon's broken ass system. Excuse my language, but if you read ATS, you know I swear a lot of that. But <laughs> it's um, I might I don't know how many of you guys would be interested in that. Once again, let me make a disclaimer: I'm not a crowdfunding guy. I just I've never really um, I've always like to do things myself. You know, I try. But um, how many of you guys would like to move over to that system? I don't want to move over to that system and then nobody nobody wants it. Just kind of like the manga. It's like, ah. In the beginning, I kind of, and I think I waited too late. In the beginning, damn near so many people were asking for it. And then I put a Kickstarter up and, and that, that turned out. But I'm not blaming, I'm blaming myself because I'm not good at marketing either. I actually just never market this system. So I'm pretty damn lucky to have you guys here watching this. So thank you for watching <laughs> Now, like I said, how many, let me know if you guys would be interested in that system. And we'll see, I'll always talk to David and we'll discuss it and whether, um, will it work or not? And we'll go from there. And at that point we'd switch from um, on Audible to non-exclusive and then um, set a goal the same way MSC does. And if it funds, it funds. If it doesn't, well, it is what it is. And but um, that way though, it will. You don't have to worry about the two to three month fucking waiting time. I mean, I'm completely fine with thing the way things are right. No, I'm not. I fucking hate that. I fucking hate that you guys have to wait so damn long. But like, I get to listen to it early. And I'm a fan of David Reimer, my own narrator. And so, yeah, I get to listen to it, but, you know, I can't. It's not like I can distribute, uh, distribute that shit myself. I'm not dealing with that. 12 was another story, and I was in the position where I could, but not here anymore. But, um, anyway, next news. Do I have any next news? Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. If you are an artist, and I'm like a uh, decently skilled anime artist, let me let me repeat that because every time I put an ad on Deviant Art, I get Western artist and um, a bunch of random stuff. I'm not looking for any of that. Um, some of the Western art is great, but like if you can't even read, you know, <laughs> you know the um, the advertisement, how am I going to trust you? To follow my art instructions, I've, I've had a problem with that last time with a um, with a character designer, a former one. Um, you guys can know that, and um, yeah, he just a lot of instructions. He just and it could have been language barrier, but I, I'm not going to let that be an excuse every time because we talked plenty of times. But um, it's like if you can't follow instructions, then how am I supposed to trust you at the job? Simple as that. That's also military logic and stuff. Just like, if you can't follow these instructions, how I'm supposed to trust you to follow these instructions? But yeah, if you are an artist, a skilled anime artist, um, like, you know, um, just hit. If if you want to work with me, um, if you if you do if you have a commission seat, like a a deviant art page, and you accept commissions. And you want to, you know, help out with ATS? You know, I would be more than happy to look at, see, and see if your your style works with ATS and commission you. Um, I'm steady looking for artists all the time. I found one who I really think 
would do great on a book cover and I can't wait to see what she does um, great manga artist man he is OG he is great um, someone tried to take his job I just laughed that was funny and and he had a, he had a huge red um, resume and some of the stuff was not bad but um you know whenever I hire whenever I bring somebody aboard I'm pretty damn loyal to them and I, I didn't think he can hold a um, candle to keep to my manga artist anyway but he was really good um, I'm not going to tell you I'm not going to give him free promotion but I, I just thought it was hilarious um, I did not expect it however the problem is I did not put an ad out for a manga artist I put an ad out for standard artist so I mean come on man yeah read read the post um, I'm leaving that ad on deviant art open so you can easily just go over to the forum and easily find that's why our four or five sits uh, but um I've already got a position filled for the book cover for volume 19 got an illustration done for volume 19 I might be looking into another one and yeah we've been missing the lewd art so I'm, I'm going to start adding I'm um, getting that commissioned whether you want it or not it's coming um, ATS is a lewd series now I'm not going to honestly smash it in your face but I'm probably I know I'm going to um, probably put it on patreon I got a channel for it now I'm not going to go all crazy so if I if it, if it goes inside the book it's not going to be good but ATS is a series in which you can't read out in public um, like allowed you can read it out in public but like you know what ATS is about and I'm trying to get some art for it now so you know what I'm saying next manga rec uh, recommendations so just one for today and the English translation translation to this would be sunset of passion I don't know how accurate that is by the way I'm just saying um, I, I got into this from the the English name of it but um I'm not even going to try and pronounce Raku Jitsu I'm not trying to pronounce that shit um, I know weeps are going to go crazy on that but when it comes to Japanese words man I'm not trying to hound anybody or try to pronounce that but anyway that's besides the point that rating is BS this manga is great yeah the <laughs> There are some pretty funny moments in this manga. A lot of really, really um grading teasers and um but um hey I bet like for you so for some of you who have wives, I bet you she'll probably love this. Um this is one of those where wives would love it. Love, but um this is my recommendation and it's hilarious. It's hilarious. I, I'm not saying that it's the best fucking manga ever. Uh, it might be around. Is it trash? Mm, maybe. It's opinion, but I like it. Uh, I'm not the only one reading this. There's another user on my Discord, and also it's caught up on it. This thing is great, man. It is hilarious. So that's my recommendation. Sure, I could I could recommend some of the, the shonen type manga. I'm not. But if I'm not actively reading that shit, I'm not going to recommend it. But yeah, ATS-19 is on its way. I just got the epilogue to work on. I we, We're still going to be waiting on the book cover designer who might be... This might take a couple of weeks for her. It depends. So hopefully the cover turns out great. Can't wait to see how the sketch looks. Yeah, and... That's pretty much it. I mean, great manga. The ATS manga is on its way. I know that's, I've been talking about that for a while. There's been complications, but hey, it's slow and ongoing. And it'll eventually be here. And we'll see how book one does before we pour into book two. I'm trying to, I'm going to try to make book one, manga one, to the best possible. 
you know, that's why I'm getting chapter one, um, episode one, redrawn, best as possible. And maybe when you see it, I mean, you'll be like, oh shit, this is amazing. Now, as for how that's going, it's going on Amazon first. Um, we'll, anywhere else, we'll look into if anybody has any suggestions. And for those who want it free, come on. Now, I could put it on my site. I could. But um, I, don't, I, don't, I don't know. I'll need to figure out how to actually pay for that. Because I'm investing way too much into this. And I know I'm not going to see a whole return unless you yeah, I'm surprised. I mean, I've been surprised about the light novels. Now, I, I'm, I'm just like rambling, rambling here. I wanted to end on this manga recommendation. Um, end that, yeah, ATS is coming with the lewd art pretty soon. Whether you want it or not, it's coming. Um, <laughs> and regular illustrations. I'm just looking for, I'm looking through... The many, many artists have have applied, but the, like the artists that just throw their resume or their thing up there and then dip, and you're not an anime artist, I'm just like, come on, man, like, did you even read the thing? Like, how I'm going to, I'm not saying an artist that work on the series has to care about the series, but if you're going to invest into this long ass series, it'd be nice to care about it. So, and um, one more thing, I think I might do a giveaway, something simple. I can't do a PS5 giveaway or a Netspot Series X giveaway because they, they're never in stock. And I'm not doing a last generation console. I could do a Switch, but that's kind of last generation as well. I could do PayPal. I don't think anybody really cares about that either. We'll see. Merch, well, I got to will it come back into i gotta get that started again there's a lot to do but yeah if you watched this far and hearing me rambling i appreciate you and if you want to do me a favor hit that like and if you if this is on youtube just see you know, like subscribe and all of that good stuff and with that being said peace